Hello and welcome to the Pick a Pattern stamp set and Honeycomb Quilt Top Dies introduction. So this is a great geometric die set and a Pick a Pattern. There's five different patterns in this stamp set. Now I've stamped all the patterns to show you how cute they are. You've got to see them stamped to see the beauty of it. Okay, so I have them stamped in several different colors. Like I said, there's five. The first one is striped. I stamped that in some buttercup ink. It's kind of a... Um, we call it whimsical stripe and then a polka dot. There's this floral, there's two different florals, like a solid and an open. You can stamp those together to create magic. And there's also a single little tri dot, three dotted like berries that you can add in an additional color. And then lastly, there's a little heart pattern. Okay, so these pick a pattern stamp sets are sized to work with the triangle in the other quilt top dies. That's a previously released triangle dies. It also works perfectly with the new honeycomb quilt top dies. Here's the honeycomb quilt cover. It's a four and a quarter by five and a half. I die cut that into some white. And then these little individual hexagons I stamped with a pick a pattern stamp set. So you can make patterned hexagons. Now, I don't know if you know this, and you probably don't care, but I have a love affair with anything geometric. So this is just tickling my fancy to the high heavens. And look how they just fit in there. It's like piecing a puzzle together. So there's the pattern hexagons. I also die cut a few just out of solid color cardstock to show you that works as well. Some of the hexagons have a die cut heart. Some have a die cut star. There's also one with a die cut high sentiment. I love that. Really cute. I mean, everything Concord Ninth is so well thought out. Okay, so there's a honeysuckle hexagon and a parsley. And then um, I got to show you a couple cards that I've created. Now for this first one on the left, what I did was die cut the hexagons. And then what I did is I cut them in half so that you could make like a two-toned hexagon just to fit as much color as humanly possible. And then that scripty friend die cut is from the Friendly Florals die set. And uh, again, the honeycomb cover die on the back out of white cardstock. A great, colorful, simple, easy to put together geometric design. Here's card number two, where I stamped the pick a pattern designs on solid color cardstock. So kind of tone on tone. So you can see all those beautiful patterns working together with lots of color. I used the high hexagon for my sentiment. It really pops on that mushroom cardstock. And that is the introduction to the Honeycomb Quilt Top Dies and Pick a Pattern Stamps. <music> 